This is Michelle Carlisle. It is. All right. Well, congratulations. You have won the What Garth Got Me Through meet and greet. What? No mm. way. Yes. I won the meet and greet. I won the meet and greet. Oh, my God. Are you serious? You're sure this was on a prank call? I'm sure. Oh, my gosh. I'm shaking. I'm very happy for you. Oh, you have just made my entire week. You have no idea. Oh, my gosh. I cannot believe this. Thank you so much. Do you want to talk about what you wrote? Yes, absolutely. Let me. Um, um, so when I was a little girl, um, my dad had one really big passion in life, and um, that was Garth. Um, he, back in the day, <laughs> when you couldn't, you know, win tickets on the radio station um, or, uh, you know, get on the internet to, to get tickets, um, we would sit as a family and <laughs> just dial, you know, over and over and over to the radio stations to get tickets to see his show. Um, and then after, um, we went to about five concerts together and I was, um, fairly little, I was probably like six or seven at the time. Um, my father passed away, um, tragically when I was, um, about nine years old and, um, Garth has, has been my dad basically in, in life form, um, when I got married, my husband proposed to me um, by a guy with a guy serenading um, us to a, a Garth song. Um, my dad's dying wish was that we play the dance and Shameless at his funeral. Um, and so Garth has been basically what I leaned on for um, my life and basically as a, as a father figure when my dad wasn't here. Um, so Garth basically got me through life. <laughs> I mean, that, that's the best way that I can explain it. Um, that's incredible. I mean, I, I am just, <laughs> you have no idea how happy this makes me. I have wanted so long to hug that man's neck and thank him for everything that he's done for me. And I know it sounds crazy to some people, but I mean, he really had, when you, as a young child, when you lose your father, um, you cling on to anything and everything that makes you feel like he's right there. And for me, that just happens to be Garth. Um, and so I, I've tried to carry on the tradition. And when he um, started playing at the Wynn, I went and saw him three times at the win, and then when he started touring again, I, you know, I just made it a mission to try to go to every concert that I can, just because when I'm at a concert and I'm listening to his voice and listening to the songs that he sings or the songs that he, you know, we played at my dad's funeral, I feel like my dad is right there with me, and there's no other place on earth, and there's no other thing that I can do to get my father that close to me, per se, if that makes any sense. That's an incredible story. <laughs> I'm about to pass out. My heart is racing so oh. much right now. Oh, my gosh. <laughs>